Hi everybody, welcome to McGuire and Son's Sawmill. We appreciate you stopping by today. I'd like to say it's a nice, cool day here. That'd be a lie to you. But you know what it is? It's warm, it's really warm, and it's sunny, and it's not raining, and I've been busy. Been busy sawing logs, been busy planting a garden, I've been busy turning wrenches on a truck on a system that I have not a clue about. But I'm learning. That's always the positive thing. Today I'm McGuire and Son. I'm going to turn you around and I'm going to show you what I've been doing this morning. It's not much of anything, but it's something. And something is always better than nothing. So hold on. So, yeah, what you see... There's a whole bunch of boards. We'll walk over here and take a good look at some of this. Look at that. Oak. Yep. All oak. All a customer's oak. All one customer's oak. And there's the rest of the log. Or the cant, I should say. Yep. I had to cut it down. It was kind of, uh, it was like nine, nine foot six. It was a beautiful log, but she had freaking nails in her. And I tell everybody, I try to tell everybody, absolutely no nails. We don't do nails of any kind in our logs. And I'll metal detect them. I've got a metal detector and, uh, yep, I check them all out. Because if they're bad, I cut them off, and they can get what I get out of them sawing. If they don't like it, Home Depot is about 70 miles away from me. They go there and buy their boards. Or they come get their garbage and turn it into firewood. It don't matter anymore. Uh, yeah, just a quick update. Nothing fancy. Nothing going on. Uh, sawing logs. Staying busy. I'll fire the mill up here in just a few minutes. I got to clean out the sawdust pit because, you know, you run it for five minutes and it, it, it's filling up fast with this oak. Uh, it's all one by and uh, that's just the way it is. I've got some one by 14s down there. We'll walk down there and I'll see if we can't get some good views of that. I got all the lumber is pretty much sold off now. Uh, I still got quite the stack. I got to sort all that and use it for my kid's cabin, I think. And I got that pile and then all this stuff and all the stuff on the ground. But yeah. Let me pause you and I'll be right back here. I'll straighten this pile out so we can see. All right, well, that's what we got so far out of some of these has been uh, 1 by 14s clear all the way through, not a knot. The other stuff down there has got knots in it. Having problems with my dog boards again. I'm starting to get a little taper on them, and you can kind of see it from top to bottom right there if you look close enough. Maybe somebody's got an idea what I'm doing or not doing right, because all my dog boards are starting to taper. Uh, but yeah, that doesn't have very many knots in it going down through there. It's got one right there, but that's about it. I'm going to saw that into one by sixes and for the customer, and then I'm giving them everything I could possibly give them out of it. You know, when it starts getting bad on one side, I roll it, and we just keep rolling it and rolling it and rolling it, and... He'll get some quarters on, and he'll get some flats on, or riffs on, and that's just all there is to it. But, I'll bring you back in a little bit when I get this mill cleaned up and we get ready to go. Appreciate you. 